Mr. Alatori, my name is Renee Meitler. I attend Hutchison Community College, and this is my first impromptu speech. I am sick and tired of rude and ignorant people. I'm a waitress at Lone Star, and I expect a little bit of common decency. I often treated as a servant, expected to wait on people hand and foot, when in fact my job is not unlike many others. I really wouldn't mind people asking for this and that over and over again, being rude if I was making money off of it. And a lot of people do good. They bring in, they leave us with money that is substantially enough for me to cover what I owe for tip share and then some extra for me to make my hourly. Because if I go three days on pay ad, which means I don't make up to minimum wage an hour, then I get fired. So take, for example, a rude and ignorant group of six I had on Valentine's Day. They came in and sat down at my table. When I took their order, I said I would go put it in for them. And the lady said, well, it's about time, isn't it? I was waiting on three other tables at the moment, and they hadn't been ready to order the last two times I'd asked them. These people would have been okay. They were high maintenance, but that's normal. I'm used to it. But they stiffed me. They sat at my table for two and a half hours, taking away about three complete terms of my table. That equal, with a six stop, that equals about $30. And I owed about $4 to tip share, because their ticket had been about $100. And so I lost money on this table. I'm sick of rude and ignorant people because no one thinks that they should have to pay for a service anymore. They think that they deserve it because they're not at home. They shouldn't have to do it themselves. Therefore, they don't look at it as it's my job and that I'm not there to please them. I'm there to make money. And rude and ignorant people come in <coughs> every night. And you, you can really apply the concept of rude and ignorant people to any concept of life. You know, you see them on the street every day parking in places they're not supposed to, in front of your driveway. They, they're, they snub people that they think are below them. But I think in the restaurant setting, this definitely comes out. Because simply, they're not, they think they deserve it, rather than that we're earning our keep. And that's why I'm sick and, uh, that's why I'm sick and tired of ignorance.